Alright, so I wanted to share an update on the Sailor Moon costume for the wig and little hair bun shields. Check out my previous video. I did a whole thing on that and showed you guys how to make it. So if you want to know, check that out. There's still a bit to go. There's a lot of details and I will share that along the way. So my costume came in and I do have to steam it because it is all wrinkly and it looks not so great right now, but I will get it looking nice. And I still have to do the button. I actually got a button to put here, but I wanna work on it a bit to make it more accurate. This is the button I got. Gotta sew this on. I wanna, I got these moons from Etsy and I wanna glue one on here and then maybe put like a red stone just to make it a little more Sailor Moon-esque. This was the best thing I could find. So the costume came with all of these things. It came with a choker, which isn't very accurate because she has a red one with a moon on it. And I'm just gonna use a ribbon and paste one of the moons that I got, one of those plain moons, they're like brass. I got it from Etsy, I think it comes four or five. So that'll definitely be enough for the choker, the gloves, and the button. Oh, and the boots, of course. I uh, came with this as well for the head and it's just not nice. So I, it doesn't even fit my head, it's too big. But I got another one. So I ordered this one on Amazon. It was about like $13 and it's a lot nicer. Kind of looks like Wonder Woman, but yeah, it just fits a lot better. The wig will cover these parts right here, so no need to worry about that. I was gonna make it, but saw it on Amazon and it was just so much easier. The costume with all of these bits came out to, I think, $13, and then you had to pay for shipping. I got mine and my sister's, and it came out to like 30 something dollars. So it's very inexpensive, and it got here in time, got here ahead of schedule, so I'm really happy about that. Not gonna be using this, of course. The gloves are huge on my hands, so I'm gonna fix it. I saw online how you could fix gloves. The fingers are very long, so I have to fix this, definitely, but at least I have the gloves. There's just a lot of details I still have to do. Here are the boots, and they're just perfect. Gonna put the little moon on here as well to finish the look, but yeah got these on amazon 30 dollars so definitely worth it they do say that it runs a little tight on the calves and i did notice that they do but they fit so i'm lucky but that is the warning that i will give i actually got a size up just to make sure last but not least i have to make the wand so i got some clay from Joanne Fabric and gonna get that done. This is 10 pounds, so it weighs a lot. We're gonna make it this way and then paint over it. My sister looked it up and apparently you can paint over this and she has the paint already. So it seemed like the cheapest option. I was able to find mine online, but hers was a little more difficult and it was very expensive. So at least this will be a fun project. Yeah, so gonna get to work on steaming the outfit and showing you guys how it looks before I add what I need to add. All right, finished steaming. I will do other videos on the accessories and everything else. And I will do a final video with the full look, boots, accessories, wand, fit, hair, etc. So stay tuned for that. Subscribe, you love Sailor Moon. You wanna know how I'm gonna get this look, then you know what? I will show you very soon, but still working on some stuff, but I wanted to do a reveal of the fit from AliExpress.